So I went to town today to go to the dentist because I had to get my teeth cleaned and then I did some shopping. So I spent a good portion of the afternoon in town and when I got home, the kids surprised me. They spent the whole time I was gone cleaning house. I thought you knew we were going to do that. I didn't know. I, I really know. I appreciate thought, it too. I thought you like, um, knew. I did know that you were going to do a little bit of cleaning, but I didn't know you were going to like do some major cleaning like you guys did. That was just amazing. I'll show you one of the things they did. Back here in our utility room, that shelf right up there was a huge mess. It had a whole bunch of random stuff up there that we never ever used that was just taking up space. And so Brooke took all of it out and then she put all of the things that were up there that we use regularly. Doesn't that look so nice? And then she did a lot of decluttering and getting rid of some stuff that we didn't need. And Miley cleaned the front room yep. and put all the dishes away. Yep. So I am just so happy and relieved. It just helped out so much. Um, it's just that much less that we have to worry about getting done now. So I need to run out to the shed and get some hamburger out of the freezer for supper tonight. And then I also need to get some ribs out because um, we're going to fix ribs for Saturday night for our Christmas Eve celebration. Once I get that done, I need to run out to the chickens and feed them because I didn't do that earlier today. I'm pretty sure they had enough feed to last them all day though, but still I'm going to go check on them and gather eggs. One of the things on my to-do list is to clean this freezer out. I'm going to have to get it done before we pick up our meat. And to see the ribs. Oh, and there they are. So Miley did all of her usual chores today. She always feeds the goats and um, takes care of the rabbits. And well, she's decided that she also wants to feed the goats hay now, which is awesome. So, um, so she took care of the goats and everything this morning. I didn't exactly come out and do my chores like I should have. And my chores consist of basically gathering eggs and feeding the chickens. Kind of weird coming out here at night. Oh my goodness, it's Nadine! She must have decided to come to the coop instead of the barn. That's crazy, Nadine. Or she just stay over here. Nadine's trying to huddle under that big hen right there. Just look, she must be cold. Look at that. How cute is that? That is a huge hen. This light Brahma here. She is just ginormous. Oh, there she goes again. Look at that. How funny is that? <laughs> the hen's like, hey, what do you think you're doing? Are you cold, Nadine? Okay, so let's gather eggs now. Excuse me, look out. Tins. I need to get in here. All the nesting boxes are full. Is there any eggs in there? Hey, Muffy. Excuse me for a minute. Whoops. Excuse me for a minute. Ugh. Ugh, I don't like blindly sticking my hand under a chicken. Because you never know what you're going to be sticking your hand in. Oh, oh my goodness sakes, there's a couple of chickens in there. I don't feel any eggs. Okay. Well, that's pretty good. I got five eggs today. The chickens haven't been laying the greatest, but surprisingly, they have been laying pretty consistently. We've been getting anywhere from three to like seven eggs a day. There's been a few years where we haven't been getting any at this time. We've been having a pretty mild winter though so far, so that might be 
reason why they've continued to lay. But either way, I'm not complaining because we are getting enough to where we don't have to buy any. Spaghetti is what is for supper tonight because it's quick and easy and I'm all about that kind of supper. Hey, Dylan. Hey. We made it here. Oh, I am fine with this. Yay. Have a good day. Yes, it was a long day. Good deal. my mind I'm all for a good start I hear the jingle bells people singing about love it feels like I'm a kid like I'm forever young and that's why so the kids are sitting here trying to convince me to celebrate Christmas even earlier than we are going to celebrate it nope, 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 nope. We can still make Christmas Eve Saturday and Christmas Day Sunday. We just move the present portion, present opening portion up Friday night. Or, I fully agree with that. <laughs> or, <laughs> that's why I said not yet. Or, we could do it uh, where we open one gift of everybody's choice. Even though they grow up, they still. Get excited over gifts. <laughs> of course! Until we had no Who wouldn't be? <sighs> yeah, who wouldn't be? But you know what? My answer is nope. No. They Why? need to learn patience. Patience like you always tell me, Brooke. It's the key. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, I think it backfired on you. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just realized... I had my hair up like this. Just to let you guys know that I do not <laughs> put my hair up like this. I would never go out in public like this at all. This is just for natural curls. So we're gonna <laughs> wrap up the video for tonight. So since I was in town listening to Christmas music all day in the car, Probably I decided- AKA just Casey James's <laughs> <laughs> I did. <laughs> You're probably kind of right. Um, I decided that, let's see. Now you threw me off. Um, <laughs> so the question of the day is, what is your favorite Christmas song? Um, probably what the 12 Days of Christmas song. Um, Jingle Bells? I like all of them, I don't know. Silent Night. Oh, I like that one. I like that one. Or a song or whatever? Yeah. What's your favorite Christmas song? Do you hear what I hear? I pretty much like all Christmas songs, but I think my favorite modern Christmas song is I Like Christmas by Casey James. It's just a happy Christmas song. Aren't all Christmas songs happy? Like, comment, subscribe, and drop a notification. Turn off! Uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on the bell. <laughs> Never miss an upload, peace out.